People living in a hurricane's path need to know its strength before it hits. To get that information, meteorologists fly through it with the latest technology. Expensive and dangerous, these hurricane hunter flights tell meteorologists how much punch a hurricane packs. But research led by MIT's Nicholas McCrees has found that this, the noise hurricanes generate under the water, tells them how fast the wind is blowing above the water. With a few sensors dropped strategically in the um, path of an oncoming hurricane, we believe it would be very practical to uh, um, get this kind of data. Underwater microphones called hydrophones have been used to listen for everything from submarines to earthquakes. The team of researchers combed years of records looking for when a hurricane passed over a hydrophone. They found it in a hurricane in 1999 named Gert. It, it looked like it was a direct hit and the satellite information showed that it was a direct hit from the eye and the eye wall. Hurricane hunters flew through Gert within a day of the recording and McCreese's team was able to match the plane's wind speed measurements to a voice print of the sound. The first peak is the eye wall, and that is the most destructive part of the hurricane, where the winds are the highest. McCrees is now working on getting additional recordings and measurements so that someday the dangerous and expensive hurricane hunting flights might be replaced by a few floating microphones. I'm Brad Closa.